Raina's room. I'm so hungry. My name is Koichi. It's not like I always eat alone, but I'm an introvert that doesn't have many friends. There is nothing special about me. Oh, curry is the best. Koichi, can I sit next to you? Oh, not fair. Can I too? These girls are Mitsue and Love. They've been so friendly to me. They are quite popular with boys, and I feel cold stares from them when I'm with these girls. Mitsue is adorable like a puppy. She is very sociable and can make friends with anyone. Love apparently grew up abroad and is a sophisticated beauty. Lots of people admire her down-to-earth personality as well. Wow, your curry looks so good. I want some. You can eat if you want. That's not good manners to ask for someone's food. Don't be so rigid. Go eat it. Feed me. What? I probably shouldn't. Here. Ah. Uh... Uh, should I do it? Really? And doesn't she mind that this is my spoon? Don't take it seriously, Koichi. She's praying with you. Ha! Uh, it was so close. Don't interrupt us. I'm not letting you go ahead of me. You can use this new spoon, Koichi. I've returned the dodgy spoon for you. Oh, -ho. thank you, love. If you feel that I'm going ahead, you can do the same. I'm not stopping you. That's not the point. You're making Koichi uncomfortable. You didn't seem that way to me. You're always like that, aren't you? They're getting along after all. Am I on their way to have a conversation? But I can't really move while I'm eating. Oh, Koichi, let's go home together. Uh, sure. Yay, look at me. Well, oh, aren't you a little too close? You think so? I don't. You must be normal to her. She's always close to anyone. Bye, Mitsue. See you tomorrow. See you, Mitsue. Bye. See you tomorrow. I knew it, but she's very popular. I know it's not her fault, but I'm getting cold stares because she's getting so close to me. What's wrong? You look so serious. <laughs> uh, it's nothing. Are you okay? Yeah, thanks. In case I get stripped again, I'll keep holding your arm. Oh, if it helps, your breasts, they are touching me. I'll try to listen to that song later. Yes, I strongly recommend it. I think you'll like it. Because I usually go home alone, I really enjoyed having a chat with Mitsue on the way home. Soon, we got to the point where we parted ways. Can we exchange our contact details? I'll let you know how the song was. Sure. I'm looking forward to finding out. It's Mitsue. Thank you for walking home with me today. It was so much fun. I had a good time too. I've listened to that song you recommended. I loved it. It's the same song of an anime, isn't it? I'm interested in watching the anime too now. She's already listened to it. I didn't know that sharing what I like makes me so happy. Hey, I'd love to walk home with you again. Sure, I'm available. That's great. Ah, <sighs> I was so nervous just exchanging messages. <laughs> I ended up talking to Mitsue on chat till morning. I shouldn't have. Good morning, Koichi. Shall we walk to school together? Morning, love. Yeah, sounds good. You seem so sleepy. Are you okay? <laughs> I just stayed up late. I may fall asleep in the middle of class. Did you stay up late because of a girl? Oh, oh, oh it's not like that. Good morning. Awesome. Lucky to see you first thing in the morning. Can I walk to school with you, love? Love is so popular. I don't desire to be next to her. I should leave here. I'm sorry. I'm working with him this morning. L love? You don't have to worry about me. You can go with her. I won't 
to work with you. Am I bothering you? Uh, no, uh, not at all. <laughs> no problem then. Let's go. I thought she respected me because she asked me first, but she came to eat lunch with me and wanted to walk to school with me again. I was a little flattered. Hey, Koichi, your parents are away and you don't know what to do with dinner, don't you? Uh, oh, that's right. But I told that to my friends, not her. How did she know? Why don't you eat at my place then? I'll be home my room and would like the company. Dinner at Love's house? By ourselves? Well, oh, if it's okay with you, I'll come over. It won't take long. I'll cook your favorite. Thank you. I've never been to a girl's room. It smells nice. I'm nervous. What should I be doing? I feel uneasy just sitting here, but it won't look good to walk around in the room. Will it? I was fidgety and looking around the room. Then, I saw something under the closet door. What is this? It was a piece of clothing that looked familiar somehow. I put it to have a proper look and the closet opened. Oops! I panicked since I didn't mean to open it. The next moment, what I saw creeped me out. What the hell? They were my gym uniform, towel, chopsticks, lunchbox, things that I lost before. The walls were filled with pictures of me taken without me knowing. This. Uh, the spoon Kovic used to eat curry? Is this the one from the other day? What the hell is going on? Huh? It's from Mitsue. Uh, uh, hello. Wait, uh, why aren't you responding to my messages? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize. Was there something urgent? That's terrible. You don't care about me, do you? Even though I'm dedicating myself to you. I'm sorry. I'm kind of busy right now. I'll call you later. Who was that? You're with me right now. Which bitch do you need to talk to? Love! You're cruel. I love you so much and you still don't get it? I put heaps of love into this meal too. A part of me that loves you very much. What do you mean by part of you? <laughs> do you really want to know? <laughs> I felt tremendous fear and ran out of Love's house. Ew, I thought you must be here. <laughs> Why were you at another girl's house, ignoring all my messages? And what were you doing at her place? I didn't do anything. I've been showing my love to you so much. Don't you love me? How can I make you love me more? Do I need to tie you up to keep you by my side? I won't let you do that. Koichi is mine! Since when? I'm the one that found him first. Don't disturb me! Who was first doesn't matter at all. The matter is who loves him the most. I love him the most. Koichi, who do you love more? Well, I... I realized that there is no escape from these two. Who do you like better, Koichi? Well, that is... My name is Koichi. I'm in a tight spot right now. Two cute girls confessed their feelings for me, which made me happy. But there was a reason why I couldn't. That was because one was clingy and the other was obsessive. A few days back, Mitsue is like a cute little puppy, very friendly and gets along with both men and women alike. Love, a young lady who's not only beautiful in appearance but also graceful in her behavior, and I, a dull and shady guy, was texting with the two beautiful girls until late at night and going to end from school together. Then, one day, an incident happened. I was waiting in Love's room when she invited me to have dinner with her. I unintentionally opened her closet where she kept my photos and other things that I used. When I got scared and ran away, I found Mitsue there who somehow knew where I was, crying that she wanted to stay with me even if she had to tie me up. 
So two beautiful girls came on to me, and here we are. If you can't decide now, how about this? Let's try going out for a week, and if you like it, we'll make it official. That sounds good. What? So you heard feelings? I won't let their itchy near you. This is how I ended up going out with two beautiful girls for some reason. Good morning, Koichi. Good morning, Mitsue. I enjoyed the manga you told me about the other day. I stayed up all night and read all of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad. But then you might fall asleep in class. Mitsue is very honest and interested in everything I tell her. Her willingness to like things with me is very adorable. Hey, Mitsue, if you are sleepy, why don't you sleep in your seat? But I feel comfortable when I'm near you. I'm so happy. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, but since Mitsue is always so close to me, the stares I get from the guys around me are piercing. But when I see such a happy and cute face, I almost forget that she's clingy. Oh, shit. I was so focused on watching TV that I forgot to check the message from Mitsue. Koichi, what are you doing now? I'm listening to the music you told me about. Why aren't you answering me? Are you busy? I'm sad when you don't answer. She's cute like that. She texts a little too often, but in a gary or endearing way. Today, I have a date with Mitsue at home. We are going to watch DVDs and read comics. But I was a little nervous because of that incident at Love's room the other night. Oh, oh wow, what a cute room. Really? It's a real embarrassing to be looked at so much. I feel at home next to you. I might just wear a sleep like this. Well, I think I'll sleep too. Yay! Let's sleep together. I can see why Mitsu is so popular. She's very emotional and likable. She doesn't seem dangerous like love. I thought she was clingy, but I think she's just very lonely. This cafe looks like something you might like, so why don't we go together sometime? I'm free tomorrow, what about you? What the heck? Mitsue is in contact with a bunch of other guys? I thought it was just me. Uh, something smells good and it feels soft. Oh, Koichi, you can't do this just because you're half a sweet. Love, what are you doing here? Because I'm your girlfriend from today, so I came to wake you up. I made your breakfast, so come eat. Good morning, Koichi. Love made us breakfast. Let's eat. You are going to make a great wife. <laughs> oh, stop it. Uh, what do you mean? I saw Love in my room this morning, and she was making me breakfast. And before I knew it, she was getting along with my parents. The weirdest thing is, I didn't tell Love where I lived. <laughs> I'm so happy to be able to go to school together like this. Let's go home together too. Oh, uh, sorry. I have a committee meeting today, so I'll be late. Well, that's all right. Good luck with the committee. Do you have a minute, Kuichi? Oh, okay. Sorry, love. See you later. Okay, see you later. Love is very dedicated and puts me first. Even when I talk to other students or co-laid, she smiles at me without sulking like Mitsue. Such care and kindness makes me forget that she's obsessive. Thanks for waiting, Kuichi. Oh, no problem. You look really cute in your outfit today. You like these kinds of clothes, right? Everything was done perfectly to my liking, from the way she dressed to the date plan. And I was beginning to like that kind of single-mindedness in love. The movie was fun, wasn't it? Which was better, this one or the one you saw with Mitsue last week? Oh, how do you know that? Did Mitsue tell you? No, I didn't hear anything. Then why does she know? Love knows everything about me for some reason, and sometimes I'm terrified. After a test relationship with Mitsue and Love, today is the day to make a decision on which one to go out with. You need to choose, Koichi. It's me, right? Mitsue is adorable and very comfortable to be with. Love understands everything about me and is very receptive and reasoning. So, I'm sorry, I can't 
didn't really choose. Why didn't you just pick me? Quit? Then what are we supposed to do? I've got an idea. If we can't get out with each other separately, let's get on a date with all three of us. And at the end of the date, we'll ask Koichi to decide. This is the last game. If that's how I can get Koichi, I'll do it. And now, I hope beautiful goes on both sides. I'm really looking forward to our date today. What do you think of today's outfit? Do you like this, Koichi? Oh yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. I think your clothes look great on you. I knew it would be too conspicuous and eye-catching to date sandwiches between these two. I can't concentrate on the conversation at all. Over here, I found some stuff from your favorite comic book. This is what you wanted, right? Here it is. There was only one left, so I bought it. Hey, Koichi, do you think this looks good on me? If you say it looks good, I'll buy it. You look good in this outfit too. Maybe we can have matching outfits. Hey, Koichi, let's go that way. Next. No, there's a restaurant over here that Koichi would love. Well, he likes that tour over there better. I knew Koichi better than you do. Oh, calm down, both of you. Alright, this is the end of the date. Pick one of us, Koichi. Koichi, I had so much fun today. With you, I can have fun at home or anywhere. I love you and I want to spend more time with you all the time. I love you so much. I will never lose this feeling to anyone. I will always be deported to you and I will live only for you. So choose me. Uh, well, I already know my answer. I can't choose between the two of you. Huh? Why? I've been with you for a long time and I've felt that I'm not good enough for the both of you. Besides, I can't possibly live up to the feelings I have for you too. No, 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 no! I don't want that! I love you so much! I don't know what I would do without you if you went away! <laughs> Oh, shoot! I never thought this would happen. I thought you would definitely choose me. No, you were supposed to choose me. Well, now I'm going to have to tie you up by force and make sure you can't live without me. What am I going to do? I'm such a helpless guy when they both have such feelings for me. Isn't it disgusting for a man to disrespect the feelings of both of them? Oh, uh, okay. And this time, I've made up my mind. I choose Mitsue. Weary? Weary? Yay! Hooray! I love you, Koichi! No! You're lying! That can't be! I know you better than anyone. This... this can't be happening. I'm never letting you go. Impossible! 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 I swear, I swear, I'll make Koichi mine! <laughs> Thank you for watching till the end. I will be grateful if you could subscribe and comment.